Oh, sorry, I just had a bit of an adventure with the uh, <laughs> with the cattle. Hang on, let's make sure they're not still outside. Um, but that was a fun way to meet the neighbours. Uh, that was a fun way to meet the neighbours. So, I was setting up camp up in the forest, but because the cows came in, uh, now I'm going to sleep in the cottage tonight. Now let me go outside and see. So I found out who owns the cows, but um, I um, I don't know how to get in touch with them. Uh, someone, one of the neighbours is gonna try to get his phone number for me, and he's gonna text me later. Um, but yeah, that was that was fun. They told me all about. The, the last person who lived here 40 years ago. And, uh, I'm not going to go into too much detail here. But it's very fascinating stuff. Um, so they used to call him the Bridgeman. Um, because, well, there is a bridge on the property. Uh, but it's nice to know that they, they call this the Bridgeman's Cottage. Which is cool. Oh, right. Now my bed's made. The cows have gone off somewhere. I don't know where they are. They're off into the woods. But uh, I was also told a little bit about the area and what's going on, who's who, la la la. And, um, sorry, someone's like taking a little slow, slow drive by to see what's going on. Um, but, uh, <laughs> Yeah, I know who's who, la la la, and then apparently there's red deer in the area, and they come through the forest behind the house, right there. Now, is this guy coming back up to me? Oh yeah, he's, peek he's peeking in again, he's peeking in again. But, uh, sure, we'll, we'll see what the crack is. Anyway, so there's red deer come through my property, so I need to, I really need to get some fences up. And, uh, oh, you know who that is? That is... My neighbour is I'm gonna go for a walk and I'm gonna find out. Oh, sorry about that. That was the uh Yoranda on the cattle, so uh so I've got the radio on here, one sec. So, uh, oh, sorry, long day. Um, that was your man that owns the cattle, and we're gonna put a fence up tomorrow. He's gonna help. Well, he's gonna put a fence up around his whole property because it's all been knocked down by the by the deer. Um, so I'm gonna give him a hand with that. And now I'm gonna eat. Finally, breakfast at 9 p.m. So, talk to you next time.